And despite the heat tonight, high school football is still set to return. And so is 13 on your sidelines. You're looking at Whitehall from high above in our 13 drone. Tonight's game of the week features Whitehall and Unity Christian. 13 on your side sports director Jamal Spencer has a look at the Crusaders. Hi, Jamal. Hey, Juliet, you know, every team in the state is trying to beat the heat tonight. You can expect a lot of hydration breaks and, of course, a lot of substitutions. Conditioning will be put to the test. And for Unity Christian, they expect to pass with flying colors. You know, the Crusaders have had a rough go when it comes to conditioning in the last few years. Last season in their opening game against Whitehall, the Crusaders failed to score in the second half. And two years ago, the team blew a 45 to 17 lead to Chelsea in the state championship. The players say those two moments showed them just how important conditioning is. This offseason, Unity Christian rededicated themselves to making sure that every time they step on the field, they're ready to play all four quarters. Guys are working way harder, and that's, that's the main thing that leaders are focusing on is encouraging while we're conditioning because we need to put forward our best effort. We just are trying to stress to them. It's like, I know. If I could skip this, I would, but we can't. You have to know how important this is. We just They have to give their all, and um, it's really still their game. As much as I want to say I'm part of it, <laughs> it's still their game. They have to give what they can give. Now, Unity Christian has to replace six offensive linemen this year, but Coach Tibby hopes an experienced backfield helps offset that loss. We're going to talk much more about the X's and O's in this matchup coming up in sports at 6 o'clock. But for now, live in Whitehall, Jamal Spencer, 13 on your side, sports.